Danny Kong. Not the voicemail. Hmm. What'd she say? Said we hadn't talked in a while. I just wanted to catch up. She was in bed, hungover. Why don't you pick up your phone then? I didn't get a call. Uh, somehow she uh, got straight through to voicemail. That's weird. Yeah, I, uh, I don't even have a record of it. Yeah. Must have been one of those little dead zones, huh? No, I don't think so. Because I woke up at home today and then showered, I went to the bank, I got some breakfast, and then when I came home, there he was, voicemail, but no call. And I mean, I had the phone in my hands the whole entire time because I was wearing my little mesh shorts. The service was perfect, too. Hmm. Hmm. So what, you, uh, you're going to call her? Nah. Good. I mean, I don't have a reason not to, but it was just a friendly call. And plus, it was my idea to pretend to be friends. Why, why did you do that? I don't know. It's like a, a subconscious thing you do. You know, you move the pieces into place so you can get a blowjob in the future. <laughs> yeah, right. Right, man. When was the last time you even got a blowjob? Well, your mom was in town last week, so... Oh, wow, look at you. Ask her. Oh, wow. Kids got chokes, right? No, seriously. I really want to know, when was the last time you got a blowjob? Exactly. You can't even remember, can you? Martha. <laughs> Martha. Hey, man, he counts. He counts. A fucking pig, dude. Hey, man, he counts. You'd be better off getting a blowjob from my mom. Count nothing. You know, your problem is you can't figure out that to be a good poet, what you need is a, a really beautiful muse, you know? A muse? Her, yeah. Beautiful. You know what? I'll leave all the musing up to you. Do it. I'm doing something different. It's working. Are you sure you're not gay? I do like that shirt on you. And then that hat. It's a dead giveaway. <laughs> Look, Danny's been calling me. Yeah, I figured she would. And Dad, how's that? Well, the last time her and I hung out, mm -hmm. I mean, it was a couple of months back, right? We, uh, we were going to that music festival, right? And, uh, I don't know, on the ride back, we just kind of got to talking. You know, emotion, substance, the whole nine. But then she asked me if I knew someone who wasn't truly fucked up. Right, if I knew someone, if I could think of someone who was healthy. If I could only think of someone. I mean, it's great. So like what, she like only thinks of me as like a shrink or something? Dude, I don't know what the fuck she's looking at you for. Because I don't want to be her shrink. Don't be her shrink. Maybe she's pitting us against each other. No. No, she's not like that. She's, she doesn't strike me as the kind of girl to do that, you know? She's... She's good. You like her. You like her, don't you? You little fuck, you like her. <laughs> You don't know. Look at you. You like her, dude. Oh. Wow. I don't know. <laughs> no. I like this. <laughs> you like her. What, you still like her? Dude, I don't know. 